The decision regarding the steel dome layered air defense system was taken at the Defense Industry Executive Committee meeting held today under the chairmanship of President Erdogan. In the statement made by the presidency regarding the subject, it was stated that the steel dome project, which we are developing locally and nationally, which ensures that our layered air defense systems and all our sensors and weapons work integrated with each other under a network structure, that a common air picture is created, that it is delivered to the operation centers in real time and that it is presented to the decision makers with the support of artificial intelligence, has been decided. Steel Dome is being developed as a system of systems by the Turkish defense industry. According to information obtained, the Steel Dome layered air defense system is being developed by the Turkish defense industry. Steel Dome and air defense systems such as Korkut, Hassar A+, Gokdemir, Gokur, Gokberk, Hizar O+, and Sipper developed by the Turkish defense industry will be able to work in an integrated manner. In addition to the weapon systems, radar and electro-optic systems that perform precise tracking, identification and classification of the target will also function as a whole within the Steel Dome. Steel Dome, which houses many air defense weapon systems, radars, electro-optical systems, communication modules, command control stations and artificial intelligence, will be the brain of Turkey's air defense field. While the development activities of the Steel Dome system continue, test activities have been started in parallel. In this context, an important gain has been achieved in terms of performing C-RAM air defense against rocket, artillery, mortar ammunition tasks with the Korkut Air Defense Gun System. Korkut Air Defense Gun System has been actively used by the Turkish Armed Forces since 2016. Aselsan made some changes to Korkut and made the system with a layered structure effective against rocket artillery and mortar threats known as C-RAM. In this regard, during the tests recently carried out, Korkut was successfully tested against an air target in the C-RAM category. Within the scope of the test scenario, the target, which was detected and tracked by radar, was locked and engaged by the Korkut weapon system via the AKR radar on it. With the 35mm Atom Smart munition with increased fragment count fired by Korkut, the air target in question was successfully destroyed with a small number of ammunition. Thus, it was confirmed that Korkut, which will be located within the Steel Dome system, can perform the C-RAM mission.